Hey love bugs, it's Roslyn back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favorite and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, let's love to you. And welcome. And for my returning subs, my extended family, thank you so much. My growing family, y'all, I mean... It's starting to pick up. It's starting to pick up. I know. I know. Y'all Y'all be sending them good wish, the wishes and well, welcome vibes. You know, y'all keep sending them. Because the more I send to y'all, the more y'all keep sending back to me. And that is just so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Just keep being you. Walking in your truth. And I mean, that makes me so happy. And for that being said, namaste. Much love to all. Love and blessings. Love and light. And many blessings definitely coming for you and if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already like and subscribe even hit that notification bell right there so you know when I'm about to upload my next video but anyways I'm just playing so you'll be able to up you know when I'm about to upload my next video and if you feel like you're comfortable enough, go ahead and drop me a line or two. I'd love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Or even if it's about the positive feedback of my videos. Or even if it's you telling me about your empath again. It's all welcome as long as it's positive. And thank you for coming to my channel. And I hope you're able to get a message out of my video today. And what I'm listening to is a like if you're on the go, but you you only got 30 minutes to go to you know got an hour and a half to two hours for work, and you want to meditate. This is the best one to do. Or if it, you want a lunch break for 30 minutes, and you want to meditate. Best one to do. This one's called 30 minute med meditation music for positive energy, inner peace music, healing music, relax mind and body. It's peaceful. Yes, and my video today is about Twin Flame 101, all empaths take one day at a time. One day at a time. You know, like, well, I mean, there are some friends that be telling me, Rosalind, you're too hard on yourself. You put too much standards up for yourself. You put your standards too high. You have to do that sometimes. But you don't have to be critical on yourself. Just like, oh, I gotta get this, I gotta get this, you know. Or, you know, I just feel like I have to have that right now. Everything comes in divine time and freedom. It's the, like, you know, there's times I say I want to hurry up and speed up the process of me healing. You can't put a, you can't put a, a you know, like, oh, okay, by tomorrow I'm going to, you know, be over everything. You can't. You can't be hard on yourself and just know that there it takes time for you to be able to heal from things. It takes time for you to be able to let go. But knowing you know, time is the essence, so I'm not saying take all the time in the world and be leisure about it, but it's just, you know, don't be hard on yourself for the things that, you know, you're going through, or the things that you suppress, or the things that, you know, that you, you know, you're still traumatized by. You know, it takes a long time for that, but, you know, first, it always starts with forgiving yourself. Forgiving yourself is always the first start, because it's just like you're always trying to forgive everybody. But then you get mad at yourself for either, you know, uh, falling in that trap or, you know, dealing with this person or, you know, getting in this situation. But everything happens for a reason. There's nothing that's by coincidence or accidents. It's really not. You know, it's just like, oh, you know, it's just a coincidence that, you know, I said this and this popped up. No, it's not. Things present itself in our lives for a reason. And, you know, we're always trying to speed up the process on things. And it just takes time. And it's just like, you know, when people want to hurry up and be in a relationship, saying, I'm tired of being alone, I want to be married now. Okay, is yourself in, inside good? Are you healed? Or do you have any trust issues? Do you have any things with you having infidelities? Do you have problems with people, you know, that you think they are going to have infidelities towards you? I mean, were you abused? I mean, there's a whole bunch of things that you have to think about if, you know, especially if you're in a relationship, you know, you have to make sure, number one, you respect yourself. Number two, you love yourself, you know, put standards up for yourself because when you know you have those three, 
you know you ain't got to worry about being used, abused, and doing anything else because you know you have learned your lesson through the heartbreaks and the mistakes that you made with other people. But they always brought lessons to your life. So never say, oh, I wish I never met this person because we do that when we get really upset with people. Oh, I wish I never met this person. But you know this person is... You have talk, learned a lot from them. Maybe next time when you, you deal with somebody else, and they, you know, they're really trying to get up under your skin. Or they really trying to be sneaky. You already know what to deal with. Because you experienced this situation before. So you have to look at God and say, you know what? That was just, you know, that blessing for you to let me know, okay, this is what I need to look for when it comes to people. Or when it comes to certain situations, when I see something about the key off, I know to walk the other way if it doesn't have anything to do with me. Or if I can't cease the situation. You know, you have to just think logical like that. You know, sometimes we have a problem doing that. <laughs> that pill called truth, you already know. You know, the truth will set you free, but first it'll piss you off. Y'all already know. <laughs> Y'all already know. I hope y'all are having a good week. It's through the middle of the week. I hope everybody's day is blessed. But, you know, just take one at day at a time. Stop being so hard on yourself. If you're being hard on yourself, you need to stop doing that. Stop beating yourself up. You being mad at somebody else. If it's something that you cannot change, let go. If it's something that you, you know, I mean, if there's some people that walked away out of your life, don't go running back after them. Don't go running back after them. They out of your life for a reason. Because I know I have folks that will just pop in and out of my life, and I'm just looking at, like, you know you don't cause problems in my life before so well, i'm just trying to figure out why you here <laughs> so it's just like I, i'm just blessed to know every experience even though it might work my nerves that i had to go through that Ooh, excuse me at the end of the day you learn something out of that situation you got something out of that situation then you have to be able to appreciate it and be grateful for that situation it can be so jacked up but after you heal from it say your kumbaya yas and meditate just know that everything has reason for happening i can't explain it but you know hey you know you know your situation no nobody knows you better than you than you so it's just things that you might be going through. Just take it one day at a time. Especially with this lunar eclipse and stuff going on. Like I told y'all, I had a headache before when I was doing my first video. So y'all forgive me if I seem like I was out of it. Because my head was killing me. <laughs> my head was killing me. I gotta go ahead and take me something for my head. Take me a nice little shower. Just relax. But I hope you are able to get something out of that message. Know that whatever you're going through right now, if it's trials and tribulations, knowing you a soldier, you're going to get through that. And just take one day at a time, knowing that you will not always go through that. There are better days coming. This too shall pass. But I hope you are able to get something out of this video. I hope you will be able to resonate. I know I said it better that time. Resonate. I don't know I said resonation. I don't know what <laughs> <laughs> resonation I meant resonate I hope you were able to resonate get something out of this video whatever blah 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 and I hope y'all have a, a, a blessed week you know it's week is almost over god dog it, I can't believe this month is almost over it just seemed like it was just like the 4th of July like what a few days ago now it's almost at the end of the month already time is flying by fast but anyways like and subscribe even hit that notification bell so you know when your girl's about to upload the next video drop me a line or two i love to hear from you as much as you're hearing from me give me some positive feedback or even want to talk about the 411 on the daggone content of my video or it's just about you tell me about your empathic gift that it's been placed upon you but whatever it is, it's positive, it's always welcome, remember. And know that you are always loved and blessed and highly favored. And knowing there was always somebody out there praying for your better days. Send out as much love and light as possible. Stay prosperous and stay blessed and know that you are blessed. And I will see you on my next video. Lord willing, peace and be wild.